Ah, thinking of Cedar Point's warm weather, all good stuff. <laughs> Betsy, say it's right around the corner. It's coming, I promise. It's okay. going to be coming our way very soon. Today was just a nice afternoon, right? We got to see that sunshine. Temperatures as we head through the night tonight. Staying on the mild side, we'll stay partly cloudy, too. There is that, so a beautiful night on tap. Satellite and radar showing not anything on the radar, but boy, the clearing was definitely welcome. As a little wedge of high pressure begins to move in, problem is there's more low pressure out to the west. You can see clouds, you can see showers. Hours, but we're planning on those showers to arrive later in the day. National Design Mar Hour by Hour Outlook. You can see this little clipper swinging into the Great Lakes region. Tomorrow morning, 8 a.m., we are still dry. We're probably still going to see some sunshine. But as the day goes on, clouds begin to thicken up. And by mid-afternoon, a cold front will arrive. That front will likely have some light rain showers associated with it. More importantly, it has a wind shift coming with it. And that wind shift will probably mean temperatures are going to fall back a little bit as we go through the latter part of the afternoon afternoon into the evening. And yeah, by tomorrow night, we may even have some wet snowflakes coming in off of the lake. On the hour tomorrow, there you see the peaking temperatures. I think we'll make it to 50. I'm going to put it out there. We get the partly cloudy skies early. Those clouds come in. Rain chances kind of hit or miss mid to late afternoon. And then those temperatures really start to drop off. Here's a summary of things in your Union Home Mortgage Outlook. Temperatures near 50 tomorrow. We will be cooler on Thursday. At least we're going to get to see a mix of clouds and sun. Mostly sunny on Friday. Looks great. Mid 40s, uh, not too bad. By the time we get to the weekend, then more rain chances are sneaking in. But look at those temperatures in the 50s before we're knocked back to more normal temperatures for this time of the year early next week. Jimmy's up next with a wrap on sports.